Welcome to What Wendy Wears. My name is Wendy and today I have a review for you. Um, I asked you on the community tab if you would like me to review workout wear and you stated yes. Then I asked you what brand I asked you about Fabletics, Old Navy, Target, or I said, you know what? Uh, let me decide. And the ver most of you stated, let me decide. So what I did is I chose a brand called Love Her. I've been um, getting this brand coming up on my Instagram page quite a bit. So I wanted to try it out. They look like they have reasonable prices when it comes to leggings and sports bras. They range about $35 to $40 for leggings, which I thought was pretty affordable compared to a lot of the brands that you buy. And they cost about $90 for a pair of leggings. So I went for the affordable brand. And on top of that, they're supposed to be squat proof. So you won't be able to see through them and they're supposed to have a pretty good compression. So let's go ahead and get started with the first review. By the way, I did not forget about our giveaway. Last week, I had mentioned to leave a comment, tell me what brand of dress you like, or um, also uh, what brand you would like to see reviewed on my channel. And I got a lot of individuals who were very interested in the $100 gift card from Amazon. So stay tuned, I am going to announce the winner a little later on. <music> Um, you're looking at this first outfit, which is the muscle tank and the pants. But before we get started on each item, I am going to grade it on a scale between one to five. And I'm going to be looking at three different items. Item number one, I'm going to be looking at the quality of the item. Number two is the sizing. Is it true to size? And lastly is going to be the cost of the item. So when it comes to this top, I'm gonna to start with the muscle top here. Um, I love the design and I love the look of muscle tops because I just love the fact that it has a large opening here so it doesn't bother me. And if you're wearing a cute sports bra underneath, you could it has like that little peekaboo. Now, um, the length, I do wish it was a little longer. Um, this one here does not have any type of design in the back. And it says be you to full, which I absolutely love the messaging on this shirt. And uh, when it comes to quality, it is super soft. It has some stretch. Um, and um, the only thing that I could say about it is that I just wish it was a little longer. But other than that, um, when it comes to the quality of the shirt, I am going to give it a five. It is thin. It's breathable material, which I like. Sizing, I bought this in a size XL and it's for a size 14, 16, according to their measurements on their website. And uh, for XL, I think it's just a tad bit small. So it might run a little bit more on the size 14 versus the 16 size uh, when it comes to the top. So um, I'll give it a three, three on that. Okay, because of the sizing, I just wish it was closer to the 16 versus the 14. And then when it comes to the cost, uh, this cost me, I believe it was 10 or $15. Um, and you know what, for, for a muscle top and coming from a workout company, I think the pricing is actually really, really great. Their shirts, I think, range anywhere from about 10 to $25, which I think it's very affordable for workout clothes. Now the leggings, this is called their, um, it is called their fire and gold leggings. It's red with gold specks all over it. And it has a texture to it, which I love. I saw it on the model and then I, you know, in person, honestly, I love it. It has great compression to these pants, have pockets on the side to put your cell phone on here. And then uh, this is supposed to be a seventh, eighth legging. It actually fits me like a full length legging. So that's one thing about the item it's a little long the back side um it is high-waisted which i like and i think it fits really good and the great thing about it is is that it is not a uh, see-through so i made sure you know i i did the little squat test just to make sure that it wasn't see-through and it's not so it's actually really good when it comes to squat proof um looking at these pants 
So um, other than that, um, when it comes to the quality, I'm going to give it a five, honestly. When it comes to the pricing, these um, cost me, I think, $25, but they usually range about $35 to $45 for their leggings, which I think it's great. And then when it, when it comes to the sizing, I bought these in a size XL, which I'm going to say they are true to size because they're a 14, 16, and um, they fit me great. I, I love them. So outfit number one. So who said big girls shouldn't wear stripes? And honestly, I really love the color on this uh, set of leggings. Um, they're just super comfortable. This actually has a different feel than the red leggings because the other ones had like that gold speck that you could feel on top. This is a lot smoother when it comes to the material. It really does feel more like an athletic material because it's super stretchy. Uh, these are a size XL, and um, I just love the print. Again, I tried uh, squatting to see, make sure that you can't see through it, and yeah, it's not a see-through material. These are called the Gray Area Leggings. They're 7 eighths in length, and honestly, these um, are more like a full-length legging because they are kind of bunched up um, behind my knee. But other than that, um, I love it, honestly. I love the feel of them. These have a lot of spandex on them, so it, it does stretch. Again, size XL, size 14, 16 uh, fits really well. When it comes to their sizing, they only go up to a, a double XL, which is a size 18, 20. So it does at least go up to a size 20. I kind of wish that they did have larger sizes because they are super comfortable and having uh, squat proof leggings are important because even if you drop something and you're picking something up, you don't want it to be see-through. I really like the feel of these. I love the material. I love the fact that the inside is also gray. So even with a little bit of stretch, you can't see a different color through it. So when it comes to quality, again, five. Um, it has pockets as well, which I absolutely love. Uh, when it comes to sizing, um, I, I think the sizing's great. Uh, 14, 16 with a lot of stretch, uh, great. And then, uh, which is a five. And then also, when it comes to the price, I believe I paid $25 because these were on sale. Again, regular price is about $35 to $45 for these leggings, and I think they're totally worth it. So, a five. So, just in time for the 4th of July, I got me some patriotic shorts. And I absolutely love the color of the red, white, and blue. I don't think it's overwhelming of the flag color which I absolutely love the way these look for bike shorts. Only thing I could say about these shorts that I don't like is that they don't have any pockets. I thought that maybe it would have like a hidden pocket in the waistband or something, and it does not. I do love the fact that this has a large um, waistband here to kind of camouflage your tummy and to hold you in because the compression on these shorts are really good. If you're kind of trying to compare them, if you own a Fabletics Power Hold, these are similar to the Power Hold of those um, shorts or those those items. However, uh, the the feeling of the material is different because this is more like a sport material versus like the cotton um, or the plush feel of the Fabletics brand. But overall, I really do like the look of them. I love the fact that the waistband is, you know, goes all the way around along with um, just the feel of the shorts. Um, the, again, wish it had pockets. So let's rate them. Quality, four, because it does not have pockets. Uh, sizing, five, because it's an XL and it fits well. And then price, I think I paid $15 because they were on sale. So actually the price is fabulous. So I would rate that a five. But even though they're shorts, again, it range anywhere between, I think like $25 to $35, which is not bad. Hey everyone, I wanted to thank all of the participants of the $100 gift card um, giveaway for Amazon. Our winner is Carla Ives. I hope I am pronouncing that correctly. Um, you are the winner of the $100 Amazon gift card for the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Thank you to all of my subscribers. I appreciate each and every one of you. So thank you so much. This is not going to be the last giveaway, so make sure that you are subscribed to the channel because there will be future giveaways. Thanks, and I'll see you all later.
So this outfit is two pieces. It's a sports bra and the leggings. Uh, this sports bra, actually, I really do like it. I like the color. I love the fact that it um, doesn't like squish my boobs like and make them look weird. Uh, it does have cups inside of these, but the cups are very, very thin. They're not very thick, so at least, you know, it hides, you know, the nipples and stuff like that, so it's not peeking out. Um, and it doesn't make my boobs look bad, which I absolutely love. Um, they, this is a size XL. I would say that this is probably a medium su support bra. Um, so if you're looking to do high impact, this probably wouldn't be it. Um, the back, though. Check out the back. I really, really love that detail in the back. Um, I love the way it looks and I love the colors. So uh, the top um, is true to size. I got this in an XL um, and then the quality of it, super soft, great material. It has some stretch to it. Um, I am a 40 C cup um, and it fits me great. However, if you have a larger bust, uh, this probably uh, would not fit. You'd have to size up. Um, and then when it comes to the pricing, again, their prices are pretty good. You know, a sports bra for like $25 is a really good affordable price. So um, I really do love this sports bra. Now the pants. Uh, the pants fit a lot different than the last two pants that I tried on. These are a little bit smaller and snugger. These are my Vino Leopard uh, print pants. So these are like a... Um, purplish color with the um the cheetah print or the leopard print on them and um it just has a different feel to them and i really did have a hard time putting them on these have a pretty good uh compression on them and i think i probably should size up on these uh because of how hard it was to put them on i can't imagine being super sweaty after going to the gym and trying to take them off it probably would be very very difficult um they are high-waisted um both front and back and i do like the look of them and i love the color of these um of these leggings they have pockets which is great so quality love the quality i really think the quality is there i love the compression on them and I love the fact that they're squat proof, even though I am basically stretching them out pretty good. Um, they're still squ squat proof. So I'm going to give that a five. When it comes to sizing, I'm going to give it a four because I really think that these run a little small compared to the other pants. And then when it comes to the pricing, I again, I, they, they're pretty good on their pricing on all of their leggings. So I'm going to also give that a five. So when it comes to Love Her, I would absolutely purchase this brand again because this is actually the first time I'm purchasing from them. So my final thoughts on the brand Love Her. When it comes to their leggings, I absolutely love the fact that they have a lot of compression, that they're well made and squat proof, which I think is very important in a good pair of leggings. Uh, would I purchase their items again? Absolutely, especially since they have such an affordable price. So Love Her is a A plus for me. I would actually use these on my workouts. And I'm starting a fitness journey, so I am super excited that I got these just in time for July 1st. There you have it, folks. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like, subscribe, and the notification bell below as new videos come out weekly and you don't want to miss a thing. Uh, in addition, if you want to see how I style the clothes that you see in my videos, please head on over to my Instagram page at What Wendy Wears. There you can get inspired by clothes that you have in your own closet. So if you like this video, I also recommended one here for you that you might like. And I also made my image here, uh, put place my image here just so you could subscribe to my channel by just hitting that button. Make it a lot easier for you. Thank you, folks. I appreciate each and every one of you. I'll see you in the next one. And stay stylish, my friends.